What's goody SBM gang? I'm back with another YouTube video. Today I'm collabing with Dola Hair once again. And I'll be using my Boho products, of course, to install this wig. They sent me over a transparent curly lace wig. And what I like about this lace is that it's very, very thin. I don't even think I put makeup on this lace. Like, it just blended into her scalp very well. So I love this wig from Dola Hair. Now this wig isn't as bad as the others, but I don't know why, but the, the factories in China, the factories in, in Japan, wherever these wigs come from, they're making the wig so small on the sides, and it never used to be like that. Like, I've never experienced these compact lace wigs until this year. Like, I don't know what's going on with the companies, but make sure you're ordering 13 by 4 wigs or 13 by 6 wigs and make sure you have space on the side so that your wig can cover your nude cap. Now I'm going in with my Bold Hold Active. Y'all already know. I think I used about three to four layers. Now let's be clear. This adhesive is very much waterproof. My client got thrown in the water and I'm going to show you the video of her hair after being thrown in the water. She was at a pool party and somebody threw her in the pool and she came back the next day and her wig was still on. Now, how do you get those type of results? Well, it starts with, one, cleaning your skin with witch hazel, two, using skin protectant, and three, applying thin layers of the adhesive. Less is more. So, when your glue is applied thin and evenly, you will have a strong hold. Guys, please don't kill me. I don't know what happened, but I forgot to press record when I was doing the baby hairs. So I did not get any footage of me doing the baby hair process. This is the only thing I got. Sorry, y'all. So with curly hair, people ask me all the time, what is the best products to use on curly hair? Water, 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 aqua, water, water, water. I don't know why y'all think these wigs is connected to y'all scalp. Y'all be trying to put moisture in these wigs. All you guys are doing is creating buildup and making the hair tangle. The best stuff to use on curly hair is water and foam. And even with foam, sometimes y'all overdo it with the foam and then y'all be crunchy. But if you want that wet look without your hair actually being wet, mousse and foam is your best route to go. But those are the only things I like to put on curly hair. You'll never see me put in no can to butter, shea moisture, hydrating mask. No, it's not that deep. It's a wig, not your real hair. Put some water and some foam on it and call it a day.
so today we went for a no part flip over type vibe i didn't want a side part so i'm just hot combing i'm using my wax stick i'm doing everything i gotta do to make sure it's flat and not lumpy And this is the final result. I absolutely love Dola hair for this wig. Yes, I didn't tint this lace at all. I didn't put any makeup on this lace. It's just good lace. The plucking is everything. You can see all the details. The hairs on the lace wasn't too thick. The knots weren't too big. Baby hairs, they fell in formation easy. It was so easy to do the baby hair, so. Shout out to Dola Hair for this wig. I will have all the information for this wig down in the description box below. Shout out to my model Gabby. Follow her on all her social medias. Guys, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. I'm almost to a thousand subscribers. Please send my page to a friend. Let somebody know to subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to grow the family. Period. SBM gang. Period.